Thank you. All right. Uh, they'll be taking on West Virginia in Charlotte September the 1st. Well, this Saturday, the Knox County Sheriff's Office will host an event called Operation Vehicle ID. It's VIN etching. So the vehicle identification number etching event to help prevent vehicle thefts. Yeah, this is pretty fascinating. And we have the education coordinator, Katie Davis, and Officer Amelia Hamilton, not just to talk about it. Uh, they're both from Knox County Sheriff's Office Services, uh, the Services Division. They're actually going to show us what they're doing and and how it helps we thank you both for coming on and actually sure. bringing the technology so the thank VIN you number we were joking about this earlier but the vin number is located on the inside of the driver door correct okay that's right so we have a scanner we use the scanner to get the vin number off it actually uh, comes to the ipad and then we talk to the printer. Mm -hmm. We print off a stencil that has the VIN number. This is attached to the glass. And then with acid, when no. you go over that number, then you end up having a frosting Look on the that. glass. I don't know if you can see this or not. We'll Probably not. Hold yeah. it there. We'll but see it here. Just hold it right. there for a moment. No. Look at right that. There. That's crazy. That's yeah. And how does this protect your car? Well, when a vehicle is stolen, typically the first thing they want to do is get rid of the VIN number because it ties them directly to that crime. Mm -hmm. So it makes it really expensive if you have to repla replace every piece of glass in the vehicle. So this is a, a great deterrent. There's others, but this is just yeah. one of them. And so we um, actually partner with the Great Smoky Mountain chapter of the Charter Property Casualty Underwriters. That's a mouthful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And they... Um, actually paid for this equipment and we provide the manpower so we provide this every year it's 10 to free. 2 on Saturday free yeah and if you have this done at a dealership it's usually over $300 and you Holy do every moly. window every window in the vehicle wow Sorry. all right so it's going to be Saturday uh, a lot across from Toyota of Knoxville and Parkside Drive 10 to 2 um, are, are we seeing more vehicles stolen these days? We are. Just in Knox County alone, um, over the past five years, we have had a 20% increase. We've already had around 350 vehicles stolen in the county this year already. Are thieves targeting a specific type of vehicle? There are specific types. Um, Honda Accords are, are big uh -huh. and of course, I mean, you know, that varies and all, a lot of times actually though, Beth, it's it's crimes of opportunity. Uh -huh. And what we see happening is people leaving their keys in their vehicle. Or a purse in the front seat. Uh-huh, uh-huh, yeah. yes. And then a lot of times now what we're seeing when the keys are left in, somebody that that person knows is still in the vehicle. Okay. Yeah, and that's never yeah. good. Yeah. Is it hard to find a vehicle when the VIN number's gone? Or if you find, it, if you find the vehicle, I mean, is it hard to? If, if the, you mean if the VIN number is gone, then there's yeah. no ID for it. Yeah. You know, I mean, you can't you, confirm that. That's... Yeah, so exactly. This is, this is very right. beneficial. So, so, sure. Yeah, well, we thank mm -hmm. you both for coming on and demonstrating the technology. Sure. Going to help sure. a lot of people.